Okay, now this needs to be said. Now, I had made a video. I did a remix on a video, okay? And people actually got triggered in my comment section. Mostly women. Actually, I think all of them were women. Um, because they like to use us men as an example. Saying that animals are more faithful than humans. And then they point out their relationship. Well, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. Animals are on a leash for a reason. Animals will stay in a kennel for a reason. If you give them the slightest bit of freedom, they're gone. Now, cats, they can leave for several months at a time, even a year, has been known, before coming back home. Our cat included. And actually, someone else must have been feeding our cat because he came back pretty dang plump. And out in the wild, a cat will not get like that unless someone else is feeding them. Meaning someone else had our cat. Because our cat came back home pretty big and stuffed. Um, but yeah, if you if another person is feeding your animal and they like the food, they will abandon you because, woo, they're feeding me. That's how an animal is. And I guess that's how faithful they are to us humans. I mean, I get our pets love us because they're forced into captivity, you know. They're forced on a leash. They're forced to be at home with us. But if you give them the freedom, they're gone. And if they're wild, they'll come up to you and hang around. But a lot of them don't like to be kept in captivity. A lot of them would prefer their freedom. To be honest, animals, yes, they love us humans. We do our best for them. We treat them nice and everything. But let me tell you something. When have you ever had to put your significant other on a leash? They always come back home. They're always faithful to you. Okay? They, they come home from their jobs to pay bills. They know where they live. An animal will not come back home. A dog, they're just gone. You know, um, but yeah, we don't have to be put on a leash. I'm sorry. And we don't need to sleep in a kennel. Okay? We come back home and that's it. I get it. Some, some people, they, they cheat, whatever. You know, but that's not everybody. And, you know, people still come back home. That's the thing. They still know where their bread and butter is. I mean, come on. You you know that if you open up that door, someone will come back home. You don't have to leave them on a leash and say, okay, I don't want you running away. It's not like that. Okay, I get a lot of us have been abandoned by our significant other, me included. But that's not always the case. If a relationship it ends, it just ends. An animal won't even tell you why they're leaving. They just do. No animal will tell you why they're leaving. But yeah, um, humans are more faithful than animals. I'm going to tell you that. I don't care who wants to argue this, okay? A human won't just disappear the moment they get a new home. They're going to live there for some time, you know, Maybe in a relationship, if an experience is bad, someone might leave, whatever. Um, who knows? Okay? But I can trust that person is going to come home the next day, and the next day, and the next day. For several years, until maybe something goes wrong. Whatever. An animal, give them one day. And they're gone. Immediately gone. Ah, yeah. So if animals are so faithful, explain why they're on a leash. That doesn't seem like uh, much freedom to allowing their choices now does it but as humans look how faithful we are just saying